The control panel is built using reliable, high-quality components. It is equipped with various kinds of alarms and also has the ability to connect to the internet for updating and for monitoring the operation of the kiln. Automatic control of the carbonization temperature makes it possible to obtain the maximum qualitative and quantitative indicators for the charcoal. The main screen includes the following options. Manual control. This is switching between the main and automatic control modes of the kiln. The main screen will indicate the set control position, automatic or manual. These are the buttons for manual control, for turning on or off, the unloading auger, the hopper and the vibrating feeder. In the temperature table, you can see a summary of all temperatures for the entire operating time of the kiln. When turned on, all temperatures are recorded in the device's memory and also to the cloud when the internet is connected. This is automatic mode setting. It is possible to set the temperature at which the automatic unloading of finished charcoal from the kiln will be performed. This parameter is the main one and is responsible for the quality of the charcoal. Here are temperature values for unloading to trigger the unloading device drive. The quality of the batch of finished charcoal will depend on what kind of raw material we use, what fraction size and at what temperature it is unloaded. The main parameters are set when setting up and starting up the equipment. And this is the charcoal unloading log. There are six unloading devices for the Biokiln 3. In manual control mode, each of them can be unloaded separately if necessary. But it is better to use automatic mode. In automatic mode, with fixed settings, when the specified temperature is reached, each of the gates will automatically unload independently, without the participation of the operator, when the charcoal reaches the set temperature. There are buttons for activating each of the unloading devices. When unloading, the unloading device will be filled with charcoal, and then discharged into the stabilization hopper below. When the stabilization hopper is filled, the auger turns on and the charcoal is discharged from the kiln. Pop-up windows provide notification to the operator of the automatic furnace control system and they alert and warn the operator about necessary actions in relation to the operation of the kiln. And this is the operator panel on which all control takes place. The controller is the brain of our control panel, which sets automatic or manual control. These are the power supplies that are needed for the controller. Relays and automatic devices are needed to turn on and off all the working elements of the kiln. Automatic devices for switching off the elevator, the vibrating feeder and the auger which unloads the finished charcoal. 